You work hard for the money. She work hard for the money. She work hard for the money, so you better treat her right. And to make matters worse, the fiend has kidnapped my little sister. Oh, the crown. Okay, I got you. Why you gotta be a mean old dick there, Bowser? You can just chill. These are some of the chillest people in the universe. They probably know some Bowser knows something we don't, I bet. You look like a pimp. I mean, I'm not, I'm not against the idea. Not your style. I only have my asshole wrapped around your head. I mean, how about this? All right, that's not weird at all, is it? I have your asshole wrapped around my head. You know? Oh, fuck. What is the... No. 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 Really? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> no. No. Really? Holy shit. It's a mustache star. Oh. Hi, bitch. Woo! Oh my god. I love this little dude. He's amazing. A little Mario frog with a little mustache and everything. This is the best day of my life. I feel like Sonic. Way! Way! This is amazing. Fuck you, idiots. I'm out of here. Bye! Yum! Oh, this is great. Woo! Oh, I don't wanna. I wanna be a frog for. Did the frog die? Wait. Did me doing that kill the frog? Oh. I got a text on my watch. Your man says hi. Alright, let's go hang out with my horse. Go that way. Do that. Oh, not for nothing, the house fetching quest. A f obviously effeminate man wearing pink and making euphemisms about his wiener and potentially hooking up with a younger man. Asking for bundles of sticks in exchange for a discount on the house. I fucking see you, Nintendo. <laughs> Bundles of sticks. Okay? Just that's it. That's all I gotta say. Hey. <laughs> Two apples for you. Horsey! I love him. Alright, I'll be back. See you later. Give me that. Shit! Ooh. All of them. Think I'm fucking around? And give me all that milk. Oh. Not your milk, the cow milk, because I will fight you, sir. But I've only ever seen bovines with horns so far. I know some species of steer <laughs> or whatever have horns when they're female, but I'm not sure which one. These look distinctly male. I don't know! I'm drinking bulges. Who gives a shit? Oh, I should search. Because I just realized I was too scared to approach these things. Because I thought they would just come to life. And frankly, some of them do. But I just realized you could search them. You know? So stupid. I d d didn't know because I was afraid to go near them. <laughs> Give me this. Give me this. I know there's stuff in here, you son of a biscuit. Uh, whatever. Alright. Got you, bitch. Hot foot my ass. I have no weapons equipped. 
I may regret this decision. I do not care, sir. Up, bitches. You can't actually kill the squirrels. I just get nuts from them, personally. <laughs> nuts. I just gotta deal with them nuts. See, I always wondered, did Ganondorf show up? Ganondorf showed up after Ganon. And was it in the timeline after Yiga showed up? So they accidentally combined the two, right? In A Link Between Worlds, I think? I have a tree branch. Fuckers. Everybody's dying now. But w what if Yiga got reincarnated with Malice and Ganondorf is Yiga and Ganon is Malice and they're two separate people? I'm just saying. I don't know what happened to Low Rule or some shit, but I think it's interesting that Ganondorf showed up after Yiga did. And their form, the pig form, is separate. I don't know. Zelda conspiracy people might know what I'm talking about. And are probably like, I see what you're saying, but no. Just let it be known. As if it oh, isn't obvious from what that stunt I just pulled. I'm not good at Zelda. I just like it a lot. Uh, I'm not an expert. I do really like it a lot. I have so many theories just from watching that shit. Like, personally... I think the Garrow and the Gerudo have a common uh, ancestry. Uh, I think that the Zoras have a dinosaur ancestry and that's why they have a common ancestor with the Ruto. You know, because they were both dinosaurs, one just went amphibious and the other evolved into, you know, with wings and shit. And Gorons are, uh, fucking rock people imbued with life. Cause why the fuck not? And then there's the little, what's the Minish? Hanging around, putting, like, rupees under shit. And being like, yo, surprise! But you weren't thinking you were gonna find money today. They're the, basically the race equivalent of finding a $20 bill in your jean pocket after you do laundry. Is basically what the Mi Minish do. And I'm here for it. Apparently they were supposed to be in this game a bit more. And there's something called the Minish Cap that I haven't played. Where you get to be a tiny Link. Like what the fuck have I missed in the past 10 years? This is amazing. Is there going to be a Blood Moon? I'm seeing some red hair. Am I crazy? Let it happen. I need fucking Flint. I need Flint. Let this stupid bitch respawn. I got stuff to do. I, I got things that have to be done. My throat hurts. I kind of want to just fly into the sun. Why are there arrows over here? Oh, this fucking chucklehead. That's why. Okay, give me that. It's mine now. Fuck you. Okay, going back to the Gerudo. <sighs> Majora's Mask, the Ilkana army, or however the fuck you say, say it. They were having a war, and there was a bloody war, and the Garrow were coming in and, like, smacking people around and shit. I think that the Gerudo are Garrow that were ousted from the land. The refugees and stuff like that. And they ended up in Hyrule with the Hylians, and it's partially why... There was a civil war because they settled and they technically were citizens and shit. But, like, there was conflict. And, yes. And it would certainly make sense that the Sheikah ha also have a common ancestor with the Garrow as well. Because they too are Shadow Ninjas. And it would also make sense because the Yiga clan are part of the Sheikah. And they're named after Yiga. And... I forgot what I was talking about. Where was the point to this? I can't see it anywhere. Anywhere on this map at all. Oh, at all, bitch! Get, come here. Come here. We're going for a walk. We need to have a chat. Alright? Look, man. I totally get it. It's not personal. You're just like a skeleton zombie dude. Right? But let's have a little man-to-man -man chat here. You fucking up. You fucking up real bad. 
You're climbing out from underneath of dirt and rocks and shit. You're scaring horses. One, you're gonna get shit on and stomped on. And two, I'm gonna come around and smack you around with your own arm. Do you see this shit? I have two pieces of you right now. Do you understand what's happening here, sir? You are at a disadvantage. The power differential is vast, and yet your stupid ass came after me anyway. So this is more like an intervention for your own benefit. Because let's face it, I'm running around with your fucking head in my hands. Okay? And this red guy's probably going to hit me like a base baseball. Actually, it'd be more like T-ball. Because he'd hit you off the top of me because you're a fucking idiot. Get out of here. Excuse me. That's the equivalent of tapping on his shoulder. This guy doesn't give a fuck. Okay. Is this how it's gonna be? Is this how it's gonna be? Let me know. Come here. Do not even try me. What was I doing? See, that's the thing about this game. It's always productive to get lost. Oh, hello. I thought you were a weird kind of like rockabilly hairdo that had gained safety as it was wandering around. <coughs> no such luck. Bye. <laughs> See you later, fuckers. I wish I could leave situations like that. Oh, what's that? My mom is calling. Bye. Down here. Navi. Listen. Navi. This 100%, by the way, is the town from Wind Waker. Alright? The one where you start off? 100% is. And look at this little... Look at... Look at... I don't give a shit. This maps and whatnot in these games are the most inconsistent shit and it's been 10,000 years. Okay? This shit is the island from Wind Waker. Look, they even have the same symbols on the doors that was on Link's belt and everything. Like, bitch, I know. Do not fight me on this. I'm not a conspiracy. I'm not a theorist or anything like that, but I know what I see, goddammit. And I see the same island, but with a lower water level. Give me everything. Bitch. All of them. Give. Give, give. Give, give. I gotta put on my favorite outfit. Let's see. Where is she? There she is. The cutest. Let's go. You do whatever you want, boo. I want these cute shoots. All of these women are my wife, so don't fucking look at my wives. Put the game down. Stop looking at them. They're mine. Hello? Gerudo Town really is full of women, isn't it? It really smells nice here. Hang on, I thought men weren't allowed in this town. Why did they let me in? Because you got big old boobies. And you ain't bothering nobody. And you can just see it on your face that you're a sweetheart. So I don't know, they probably thought you was adorable. Anyway... Will you leave this lady alone, Tracy? She doesn't want to talk to you. What? Oh, walk without rhythm won't attract the worm. Oh, uh, yep. Okay, honey, just put on a sweater. You're all right. It's not white. It doesn't match. It looks stupid. My mom made me wear it because it's cold out. What the fuck is happening? I don't know where I am anymore. I know I killed him old Dugo. This is garbage. Hell yeah! This game. Fucking metal. Look at that! Look at that! How cool is that? Amazing! 10 out of 10! Yes! 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 It's alive! <laughs> 
see, here's the thing. I don't give a shit about that gender shit. I, I don't care. Like, just fucking... You tell me what you want to be called, and I will do my best to not let my attention deficit get in the way. That's it! All it takes is practice for me. I will just continue to fucking do it until I get it right. Do not worry. I don't give a shit about clothes. If you buy them, they're your clothes. Wear them however you want. I don't give a shit what it is. I think, what was it, Iggy Pop who said it? It's just like, this isn't a woman's dress. This is my dress. I fucking bought it. Just like a woman's pants would be her pants because she fucking bought them. So you know what? Sometimes Link just wants to wear a cute little veil. And it's okay. Listen, listen, man. We talked about this. Okay, no, you come back here. You can't avoid this. Don't ignore me. We're gonna talk this out. I am tired of this nonsense. You understand this, sir? Sir, sir, listen. I get the feeling you're not listening to me. After our last discussion, I thought we had really break it, broken some ground, okay? We'd really just, you know, really bonded and really looked at each other as equals. I thought you listened to me. I thought you respected me enough to listen to me. But no, 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 no. You don't. You don't. Because you came back at- no, shut up. You don't get to talk. You be quiet. Because you came back at me all snippy-snappy and all that garbage. And look, now you're getting your friends involved in it, making a scene. Just all I did was ask you to be more polite to me. That's it. That's all I asked for. No, now you got your friends all over the place trying to fuck me up. Fuck out of here. Like, are you serious? Are you serious right now? No, we're not done with this conversation till I say we're done with this conversation. I don't give a shit. You and your little cronies back there could fuck off and die for all I care. Like, you've been through life already. You are literally a corpse. You can't do this shit. You can't take five minutes to be polite. You can't take five minutes to just be nice to people and not hit them with sticks and shit. Because I'm pretty sure I still have your cousin's arm in my backpack as we speak. Listen, listen. It's been nice talking to you. See you next time, bitch. Bye. There's a goddamn dragon over there. I don't know who he is, but he is in the shape of a friend. And I too would like to be interpreted as friend-shaped. What do I have to do? Do you like apples? My horse likes apples, but do you like apples? Because I got some. I got some nuts, too. Them tasty nuts. Okay. See how it is. Can't fight Mulduga, so I guess we doing this. Hey, bitch. Just keep hitting him in the eye. And then it disarms them. Stationary ones ain't are a piece of piss. It's the ones that move. Get you. There we go. Yeah. Wow. Hello. Excuse me. What the? Why am I on fire? Very confusing. And booyah. Alright, dummy. Just fuck it. Yeah, let's move it along. Thank you. Alright. Are you alive too, sir? No? Alright. Fucking stay that way. Thank you very much. And he's just like, yo. What's going on? Oh, I got a fucking leaf on my face because... Uh, see, here's my theory with the Koroks and why they have leaves on their faces. So I don't... Uh, there's probably lots of lore that I'm missing. But what I've interpreted out of this is they used to be the Kokairi. And when... At some point, the Deku Tree made them into the Koroks. And I personally believe that a Deku seed was planted in each and every Kokairi and the plant grew around them and their faces are skulls. 
it's just me being a skull goth kid. I'm sorry. It's just, it's just can't help it, you know. All oh, right, that's not explosive. Any but, <laughs> that's just me being a weird, morbid goth kid, I guess. It's fucking skulls. That's why. That's why they got leaves on their faces. It's because the skulls make them cutest fucking characters. The most disturbing. Because they could be like Redeads. They could be like Hanewa. You know? Like. This used to be a challenge. Then I got money. <laughs> and I bought explosives. <laughs> and it wasn't that challenging anymore. 